my gosh. This video is gonna be so cringy. What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below so that we can be friends. But even if you don't hit the subscribe button, we can still be friends, I guess. So as you can tell by the title of this video, we are going to be doing a fall fashion video. So if you can't catch on during this video, this is meant to be satire, something just funny and for entertainment, I'm not trying to insult any type of person. Mostly I'm just making fun of myself because I have definitely worn one of these outfits probably more than once in my life. So I hope this video is funny and relatable for you guys. And if you liked it, don't forget to put a like on this video. Why did I say liked in the past tense? Because you haven't watched this video yet. And if you wind up liking it, don't forget to put a like on this video. And let me know in the comments below which one was your favorite outfit. And if any of these are relatable to you. So this is my I'm in the worship band look. If you're a Christian, you know that all members of the worship team look a certain way, it's usually with some muted tones, a jean jacket, usually some ripped skinny jeans, which I don't have black skinny jeans that are ripped, so this will have to do, and then a cute little booties, and don't be fooled, worship band members who are guys typically look exactly the same. They usually have some really cute little hat thing, but I don't wear hats, so that's not going to happen. I'm in the worship band. And I'm not even gonna lie, this is the outfit I wore to church today, so call me basic, but I'm one of those people, so. All right, this is my, I woke up early outfit on a Saturday so that I can avoid people seeing me while I go get my Starbucks. And I'm not even gonna lie, this is the outfit I wore to go to Walmart yesterday. And it consists of, a messy hair bun, an oversized sweatshirt, which to be fair, I don't have any sweatshirts that fit me the right way, so there's that. And then sweatpants, and you can't tell, but Ugg boots. And before you say anything, yes, I am wearing Ugg boots, number one. Number two, they're not real Ugg boots, they're knockoff Ugg boots because I don't have money to shovel out for real Ugg boots. And I don't even think Ugg boots are even still in style or relevant. Also, not gonna lie, if I was allowed to wear sweatpants to school in college, this is probably the outfit that I would wear every single day. This outfit is the I'm refusing to admit that summer's over, so I'm gonna wear booty shorts until it snows outfit. You know those girls that just can't let go of their booty shorts and their tank tops, and they wear this to school, and they wear it out, and you're like, girl, aren't you freezing? Because I'm freezing just looking at you. And to be honest, I'm pretty cold right now and I'm inside, so. All right, this outfit is for all the guys out there who, I don't know if it's a pride issue or whatever reason, they just cannot wear layers when it gets cold. They'll still be out there in their baggy shirts and their, and their shorts. Like, there's lots of cute jackets out there you could put on. You don't have to freeze just to look cute. This could also work for those guys who are like, up is that north yeah that are from like up north and they're like oh this 40 degree weather is like so cool this is like perfect weather right here and you're like next to them in a winter coat mittens and a hat on because you're freezing i used to have a friend like that in college where i'd be like all layered up and he'd be just be walking around in the short sleeves and short shorts he's like yeah i'm just living for this weather i'm like yeah I'm just living to get back inside my room where I can put on sweatpants and a sweatshirt, drink some hot cocoa, and curl up in my bed. But, okay. Also, shout out to my brother for letting me borrow his shorts. I didn't ask you if I could use them for this video, but I did anyway. You were telling me the other day that you always watch my videos and I don't believe you, so this will be a test because if you actually watch this video, you'll probably get mad that I took your shorts and we'll say something. But I don't think you watch my video, so we'll just have to wait and see. I'm calling this outfit the I'm a hipster and I have to wear turtlenecks every single day to maintain my style outfit. These are the type of people where you see them walking in school or out in public and you have this internal debate of whether or not they're actually rocking their turtleneck or if the turtleneck is just not, it's not cute anymore. I mean, when I was in high school, turtlenecks were not cute whatsoever. So I don't really know what the fashion is these days. I'm old. 
Alright, this outfit is called I'm trying to look cute but I can't because I'm short and nothing ever fits me right. So if you're short like I am, I'm 5'1", 5'2 on a good day. We can't wear certain things that, I'm going to say normal people, but taller people wear. Like long sweaters because they go down to your knees. And then if you want to pair it with a cute long boot, the boots go all the way up to your knees. So you just kind of like sink in as one blob. And it just, it doesn't work for us. Alright, I'm calling this outfit the sporty chic look. Where you want people to think that you spend a lot of time on your outfit. When in reality, you woke up, rolled out of bed, pulled on an oversized sweatshirt. Slapped a baseball cap on because you don't want people to know that you didn't shower this morning. And really you're just hating life, so. And last but not least, this is the outfit you throw on the second you walk through the front door after a day at school or at work. An oversized sweatshirt, hair up in a pony, or a messy bun. Pajama pants, and yes, these are Aeropostale pajama pants. And no outfit is complete without fuzzy socks. So you gotta always have a couple hundred of those in your drawer for the fall and the winter. Not gonna lie, this is the outfit I'm gonna stay in for the rest of the day because I gotta edit this video. If you made it all the way through to the end of this video, round of applause for you and a gold star. I greatly appreciate it. If you like this video, don't forget to put a thumbs up on it and comment down below your favorite part. Or if you have any other video suggestions that you would like to see me do. I am still sick, so, and I know I've been saying that for weeks, but it's true. I'm working on all the covers that you guys have requested, but once I'm better, I think I'm going to do maybe like a seven-day marathon of cover songs. Don't quote me on that, but I'm planning on doing that once I'm better. So if you haven't subscribed, make sure you do so you can be a part of those when I upload them. And I hope you guys have a good rest of your day, and I'll see you in my next video.